Former Bee Branch Water Association employee facing charges after stealing tens of thousands of dollars from the company. KRK Forest Kaylin Reardon was in Van Buren County today. Kaylin, how long has this been going on? Quite a bit of cash here. Well, Bob, the chairman of the board of that water association tells me that she's been taking money from the company for the last four years and that all that time they were struggling to continue their operations. She uh, compared it to gambling or to drugs. You know, once you get started, it's hard to stop. Richard McPhail worked side by side with Virginia Watson at the Bee Branch Water Association for more than a decade. He says he was in shock when he discovered Watson was accused of stealing money for years. The way it looked was every bill that we paid, every invoice we got, she'd make one out to herself and sign my name to it. McPhail says the board confronted Watson about it. She came in and admitted that she had took the money. He says they found out about it because the company had been struggling to stay afloat. They attributed their financial instability to water loss, but after making repairs, McPhail says there was still no money. So he hired a CPA to do an audit, and that's when they found out how much money was missing. The bet was around roughly $173,000 and it went over a four-year period. The board fired Watson in July, and she was arrested last week. While McPhail says they haven't seen any of that money reimbursed yet, they're at least breaking even now. She stole from the 1,300 uh, meter that we have out here. Everybody's got a meter got stole from because she has taken more or less public funds. And Watson is now facing charges, including felony theft of property and forgery, and she's due back in court in December.